Hello everyone, welcome back with a new video that is flower parts with me Ujwala on our channel UM Sense. Let us quickly start about the part of flower. Before that, let us learn what is the exact whole plant parts are there. So when we see or observe any plant, first we'll observe the down portion in as a root. Then after the whole filamental stable structure is a filament that is stem. Then after the major portion consists of leaf, a greenish portion. Then obviously there are fruits, some birds are also there and the main portion that is flower. The beautiful lustrous flower in each plant. So when we see the flower, majorly it consists of the upper beautiful portion consists of petals is a main flower. Beneath there are some leaves are there and then after the down portion to support the flower is a stalk. Now let us see what exactly the flower consists of. So whenever we observe any flower, first we observe the colorful beautiful petals. This petals is known as corolla. Then after the green portion, when the flower is in budding stage, this green portion will cover the flower. So this green petal at the end of the whole flower is known as calyx and exactly it is not a petal it is known as sepal. Then after the between portion as you can see over here it is known as a pistil it is a female part of this flower as the flower is a reproductive organ. So this is a pistil. In this pistil the uppermost part is called stigma. The down filamental structure is known as style and at the bottom there is a round area known as ovule inside which too many ovaries are present. Then here as you can see this whole portion which is around this pistil is a known as stamen. This is a male portion and combinedly all the stamen known as androsium. If we see in detail, the uppermost portion of the stamen is anther. Inside this anther, too many pollen grains are being grown. When they become completely mature, it will burst and they will come out of this anther. The down portion is known as filament will support the anther. And this is how the whole male structure is being formed. The bottom the place where the whole flower is being situated is known as receptacle and at the end of this whole flower and with the support system there is a pedicel to hold the whole flower. So this is how all the structure as the beautiful colorful corolla covering by a calyx inside the internal style and stigma consisted gynosium that is female organ then the anther and filament combine the stamen that is male organ and the bottom that is receptacle and pedicel is being present. So this is the whole flower structure. According to this flower structure there are majorly four circles. It is known as wall. As you can see over here the outermost wall that is calyx made up of sepals inside of which is a colorful corolla it is a second wall. More than that, the third wall is a stamen that is androsium portion male part and the central portion is a fourth wall consists of ovary that is female portion. So combinedly all these four walls together make the whole circular structure of the flower. Thank you very much.